Borneo, the third largest island in the world and home to one of the greatest biodiversity of plants and mammals on the planet, is also home to one of the most critically endangered animals facing extinction, the orangutan. Orangutans live mostly in the tree canopy, swinging gracefully and deftly through the rainforest. Here in Tanjung Puding National Park, we find wild orangutans mixed in with captive released ones, playing and waiting to join others at the feeding platform. Due to the loss of huge areas of primary forests on the island, there is not enough food to feed all the orangutans that live in this area. The park supplements their diet with native fruits and milk for additional protein. You can see the young, the old, females and male orangutans sharing the platform, though there is a hierarchy in who gets what and when. The orangutan-mother-child relationship is one of the strongest in nature. The young will remain with their mothers for around eight years, learning where and how to find food, how to avoid predators, and how to build sleeping nests. Their name means person of the forest in Malay, and they play a vital role in maintaining the health and the rainforest ecosystem they live in. They are one of our closest relatives, sharing more than 97% of our DNA. Orangutans are the most critically endangered great ape on the planet, as their numbers have plummeted by more than 80% in the last 20 years. Much of their habitat is already destroyed, having been replaced by palm oil plantations and the illegal logging trade. At this rate, the Bornean orangutans and other endemic species of animals on this island will be extinct in the wild in the next 30 years. If we do not stop the uncontrolled destruction of their habitat, these innocent victims of the forest will be no longer. We must act now by protecting what is left of their forest. We must ensure that companies only use sustainable palm oil and we must demand stricter penalties against illegal logging activity and illegal pet trade, which will sell young orangutans as exotic pets or use them as tourist attractions. This cruel activity should be banned in all countries around the world. You can help save orangutans and the forest. Do not buy products with palm oil or its derivatives. Write to companies like Nestle or Nutella and tell them to use alternatives to palm oil in their products. And support organizations that either directly or ones like Safe Worldwide that partner with organizations that rescue and rehabilitate orangutans so that they can go back in the wild. Orangutans face an uncertain future and each one of us can have an impact on their future survival. We must all do our part so that these gentle sentient beings are around for generations to come.